Oh, Seems, right. Well, that's... Okay, so let's see. Oh. Look for a trash can. Looking for a trash can. Well, there's trash cans over here. Why did we say that trash can? Well, there's one over here. Uh, but that it's looks heavy. used. I'm not sure if you can use that. Uh, I'm using. I. Okay, I'm looking. I have a flamethrower, barn burner. Yep. So equip the flamethrower and then use the barn burner to see if you found a host that works. If it doesn't, the flamethrower will break down like warlords. Okay, um... There's a golem now coming now. Well, he stays over there for now, so I guess that's okay. Okay, it's equipped. Um... There comes! Bar. Can you get it to work, given him? Um, let's see. Um, how should I make it work? Test the flamethrower. You equip the flamethrower and then you use the barn burner. The other item you got. That is the barn burner. Well, it's green with a flame on it, and, called, and it's called "Burn Down the Barn." Oh, I have it. Okay, so. Oh, Jesus! This this is a new code given here. Okay, now we just need to find Warlord Holmes. Um, can you search that trash can now? Well, First, I have to go back to Danny and get the half-finished flamethrower. I just set that. Oh, all the way back. All the way back. Yes. Wait, Danny? Yes, Danny! Danny Dufresne! The guy who had the half inch flamethrower. Hmm, huh. that's weird. Well, okay. Well, it's just because mine says show a flamethrower to Edgar, so I just got confused for a moment. Okay, um, well, let's get moving. Also, am I the only one under the impression that we get a lot of pretty good loot at this point? Alright. There, you should all have a completed mission now, right? Yes. No, uh, but, uh, no of course not you. But, um, okay, let's see. And the report is just the generic. Yeah. But we get the bomb girl, so that's something. Yep. Yeah. But I, I think I will equip my normal weapon now. So I can just say collect this, and then we wait until Warlord is through with this. I'll just put my pipe back in place. But now we have a flamethrower if need be. I can always come ah. in handy. Also, Cobra, now that it's something to brag about, but this is my new shotgun. It is smaller and a bit more sleek, but it still does a lot of damage. Now I'm deleting some things from my inventory. Yeah. Alright, um... Okay, we'll just skip this part since all of you already know what's going to happen. So we'll be right back, people. And we're back. Okay, so apparently this is some sort of anti-drought barrier. That's kinda cool. It's a little eerie, to be honest. Like it's both poisonous, fiery, and icy. Yeah. Well, we should probably get moving. Hey, you just. No, wait, the escape part is this way. Alright, sprint, and there we go! Um, okay, you go that way, we'll just pretend we never saw each other. 
I'm fine with that. You know, when Wait, I think... I'm in a hole. Just a moment. Oh, yeah. Anyway, you were saying, Rona? For some reason, this here coat of mine sort of reminds me of my own from real life, only brown rather than and black. And my computer overheated. Give me a moment. Sure. We'll be right back, people. Right, we are back. Alright. So the next mission is ATC. A highly secretive group has set up camp at the local airport. Danny has tried spying on them with makeshift surveillance equipment, but his plan plans are constantly foiled. He suspects foul play wants to help figure out what's really going on. Okay. Uh, everyone ready? Yeah. yeah. Alright. It's a little flickering on my part, but yeah, I think ready. Okay. Click. Taking a break from saving the world, huh? I bet you've been out there punching darkness in the face and kicking evil in the ass and balls. Nuts. Yeah. Or maybe you've been checking up on the MIBs. That too. Oh, dead guys followed by very much alive guys in black suits and black vans. Connect the dots. Anyway, that's what I've been doing. Connecting the dots. I rigged one of my RC planes with a wireless webcam. No biggie. Super easy stuff. Mm -hmm. I already did it last year for, um, research. Not to get footage of Mr. Rosen, <laughs> my math teacher, watering the flowers in his underpants. That's like not what the, your psychology profile that said. Flying this thing is like, uh, like air traffic control in Silent Hill. <laughs> I pretty much. I get all his references! Force. And then every time I get over the edge of the MIB camp, wham, it goes dead and it goes down. They got some kind of signal scrambling going on. Maybe even EMP? I'd so love to get my hands on that tech. Of course, I got like mad skills, so I manage to salvage the plane every time. If I have to keep pulling it out of trees and gluing bits back on, I'd really like to see what's going on inside that perimeter. Like Mr. Rosen used to say, try, try again, Dufresne. Of course, he's a zombie now. <laughs> Not that he's changed much. He's still Mr. Rosen, and he's still wearing those way too tight underpants. Okay, I really hope we don't run into that zombie. I, I don't need to see that. Well, on, a, on the note of, of costumes, Danny thinks I need a new one. A what? While we were waiting, I was just sort of making him say stuff, and he said I need a new costume. He's thinking mm. tight leather, but no cape. Huh. Huh, that could be um, mm. <clears throat> interesting. Yep. In any case, I want to use the RC plane, and whoa, what's going on? So I also use it. Yeah. yeah. Whoa. Whee! I cannot use that object right now. Apparently, I can now. Where oh. are you? Up, up, and away! Well, that happened. And I'm just flying past a couple of trees and. So yeah, what he said always happens, happened. So let's go locate the plane. Marvelous. Uh, guys? Yeah? I just noticed something I don't think we should appreciate. And that's the fact that, if I'm not mistaken from the little details I got out of that cutscene, I saw a black helicopter with some red linings and it looked pretty much military or armored. Like that one flying up against there? Maybe, I don't know. Could that be the Roche group who are keeping an eye on everything? I've been wondering about that helicopter. Yep, yeah, I say it could. Alright, so we got the Phoen uh, Phoenicians, we got the Roche, we got the Morning Light, there's all of our organizations involved with it all, plus we have a ton of d undead Scandinavians coming up and going BLAH at everyone, along with the local dead, lots of ancient dead uh, cults that's come back. To the undead. So yeah, that's a lot of things involved here. Plus, of course, the whole fact that we accidentally released Jack O' Lantern. So we can add that to the pile. Mm. Mm. Uh, by the way, and there was and there was a revenant in the area too. That's true. Okay. Um. Wait a moment. We... Wait a moment. Hold up. Sorry, guys. I got stuck behind a dumpster. Okay. Is that an earth golem? What? 
I think that's an Earth Golem. It's called an Earth Spewer. And it looks rather cross. I don't think we should get close to it. In any case, uh, Wallet, just a moment. We are uh, catching up. Also, apparently, Nia Lathos has something to do with this, remember? Yeah. What way, please? With that um, signet we found of that uh, crashed ship. Ship. Yeah. Ha. Uh -huh. Alright, let's get moving. Of all the enemies, I'm probably most... Oh! Uh, watch out! Golem! Golem! Mod slide, Shambler. Takes more to kill a Crusader than a bunch of mud. Personally, I'm looking forward to facing my last step to leave. Yeah, that really doesn't sound like my idea of a good time. I... Alright, why the hell is there so many golems in the area? Oh, he's going to be hit by that thing. Uh oh. Oh, by the way, uh, speaking of my last step, I've. Uh... Uh, ordered a board game called Elder Sign, which is based in the, uh, Cthul which is based on the Cthulhu method. It's basically Call of Cthulhu as a board game. I think I heard about that once upon a time. Uh, anyway, so I, ju I just wonder if any, if any of you oh, would so like to try to play it at one point. Yeah, we can always yeah. do that when you... It has far too little heal power. Fast. You're not talking about the board game, I assume. No, the uh, wristband that was on offer. Okay. So it should be around here somewhere. It's over here. Oh, well, there's a golem on top of it. Ha! There we go. Oh, and there's something new! No, wait, that was not something new, it's not something old. It's just muddy. Ooh, pictures! These pictures show the position of three EMP generators. Huh, interesting. Well, let's go break them then. Alright, let's go. Wait me, I, got, I still have to examine the plane. Oh, sure. Yeah, now I'll click on it. Alright, Rana, have you examined the plane? Yep, disable the southern EMP generator. Okay. Well, let's get moving and let's try not to find any more golems, if we can avoid it. Alright, let's walk over here. Let's hurry. Hmm. Behind us! Another one incoming! Oh crap. Uh, yeah, that's seen us. And it's a bit bigger, I believe. Um, I also find it interesting that these golems have absorbed barbed wire. To empower themselves. Well, they're near junkyard. I guess that does make sense. Right in the back. Alright, I think we need to cross over here because it looks like there's a wall there and we want to get on top of it. So let's walk around here. Through Where are you here. Back? Yeah, over there. Oh, oh no. by the way, another one is incoming. Okay, you guys are supposed to walk around them. We won't, at least I were trying to avoid them. And now you walked into another one, Rana. I don't do stealth good in this case, sorry. It probably wouldn't be correct to say that you just don't do stealth. But hey, I have some healing anyway. Thank you. I don't do stealth well in this game, I'm just saying. Leave given here alone. Thank you. Drop. Don't back that guy either. Leave her be. Alright. So now with that thing finished. Oh, watch out, watch out, somebody's been laying out bear traps. 